Oh my god, do not freak out. Do not freak out. Don't freak out. Just don't freak out. Okay, let's, we can do this. We can do this. Don't, don't freak out. These sums, they look scary, but don't freak out. Okay, uh, if you look very carefully, this portion here, that's not, there we go. Okay, notice that this, this is a derivative of x to the power of k plus 1. So notice that, right? Here, huh, we have 0, huh. This is very suspicious, right? If I rewrite this as k x k minus 1 to k equal to, well, we can't have 0, right? So we, this has to be 1 and 2018 be like 2019, 2019 here. Because if I put 2018 here, it's 2019, and then 2018 here, 2019 minus 1 is 2018, so it matches. Okay? And then here we have x to the power of k from k equal to 0, 2019. Ha! Huh. This looks interesting, right? It seems like this, the derivative of this is this, right? Obviously, you could, you know, Okay, uh, but it's just we can't have a zero. You could technically have a zero, actually. You could do if if that makes you more comfortable, so that it matches. You could do that too. Just know that the zero doesn't it doesn't do anything. Okay, so so yeah, you could do that. So now you realize, oh, it's just it's just a u substitution. Let let this equal u. Ah, so now you have ln of x minus one plus and then ln of u right which is this whole sum thing right so and and you for those who are uncomfortable of me doing a u sub of a sum think of it as let u equal to 1 plus x plus x squared plus up to x to the power of 2019 right think of it like that so yes you can use sub summations like this it is it is allowed okay it's uncomfortable it's unusual but that's it's better than writing this whole thing out okay so and that's what u is right so of course that's what we have we have this we have ln x minus 1 plus ln of 1 plus x plus up to x to the power of 2019 right uh, you I the ellipses don't ever leave your answer like this because that's dangerous you will get eliminated this is not acceptable you can't have ellipses in your answers so but what we can do we can't have sums either <laughs> but we but you can also um, you can actually multiply both of these it's a it's an identity right for those who don't know right x minus 1 x squared plus x plus 1 things like that x cubed minus 1 right or things like x minus 1 x cubed plus x squared plus x plus 1 this is equal to x4 to the uh, minus 1 right and so on it's an algebraic identity right so this is the same thing here we have x to the power of 2020 minus 1 I think that's correct right because this does reach to 2019 yes it does so our answer should be ln of x to the power of 2020 minus 1 plus c. If I can check my answer, um, 1 minus x to the power of 2020. Uh, well, thank God for absolute values, right? Uh, it didn't, I mean, I, I didn't really, there's no, there's no bounds. So if it was from 0 to 1, then yeah, their answer would be correct. Uh, but, I mean, it's indefinite, so I think it should still be good. Uh, like I said, absolute values, I, even though they don't mind absolute values, so it's not required, but for me, it's it's the safest thing to do is, if you have LNs, put put in absolute values, okay? It's the safest thing to do. It kind of, It's kind of like uh, accepting all domains, right? You know, this could include those above more greater than one. Okay? Because it's not an infinite series. This is not an infinite series. So this this is acceptable. Cool. 
I hope that helps, and I'll see you guys in the next video.